Josh Allen, he's scary. We give him no hope, man. No hope. Play one. And he'll cuss you out. You suck. Of course, you suck. Really? Yeah, he'll, he'll talk nasty to you. But Burrow won't. No, Burrow, he's just, he's polite. Hey, Vaughn. Joe, nice to meet you, brother. But Josh Allen, he'll get nasty with you. He got a little attitude about himself. I love that, man. I love it. I love it. I love it. Josh Allen, Josh Allen, Josh Allen. He's like a superhero up there in Buffalo. He's like freaking president. Number 17 gets a lot of love in Buffalo. I love it, I love it, I love it. Love y'all boys, love y'all boys. You can feel the love at the end of every pregame huddle. Go get a job done today. One, two, three, one, two, three, three. I love you, Josh Allen! One, two, three, one, two, three. I love you, Josh Allen! One, two, three, three. The guy literally throws up before each and every game. I've never seen him before, but literally before each and every game, he'll throw up and then go out there and just run people over, hurl people. He's a fun, loose guy, just like a big kid out there. Super fun, man. He's got like a handshake with everybody. Yeehaw. 60 minutes, man. 60 minutes. I love it. I love it. I love it. Huh. Let's go. Hey, put that bell. Here you go, here you go, here you go. Certainly early on in the year, I said he was playing as high of level as I've ever seen in, in my time in the league. Who was the toughest quarterback that you faced? <sighs> toughest quarterback? I mean, the first two to come to mind were Lamar Jackson and Josh Allen. All right, for sure, me too. Favorite Josh Allen play from last year? Um, favorite Josh play. Damn, that's hard. The play where Josh Allen runs right before his foot gets out of bounds, throws across his body to Dawson Knox for a touchdown. It's got to be a defense's worst nightmare. I mean, they got to cover every single inch of that field. Keep him in the pocket. Allen dancing around in the pocket, trying to find somebody in the end zone. Throw, punt! Probably 85% of the time, if you let him roll out, something bad for the defense is going to happen. Back against the grain. Every no-no there is known, and Big 17 can pull it off. So all of us start moving to the left a little bit, thinking a scramble drill, left side of the end zone, and then all of a sudden he just pulls up. The vision of seeing the other side of the field and the arm strength to get it there, I mean, yeah, he's, he's pretty good. He do it all. He runs, he, can, he has an arm, he's accurate, he can read defenses. Josh Allen Allen! The guy just pretty much has it all. Josh Allen, he can bust you for an 85-yard run, or he can throw it 75 yards with a flick of a wrist. Josh Allen rolling out to his right, points down the field. Josh Allen, move here, move here, do this. Oh, how good of a throw is that right over the top? Hey, no, I mean, no, 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 no. Josh has a cannon, man. He has a cannon, so you know he can make every throw. Diggs outruns Jonathan Jones down the sideline for the touchdown. He's hard to play for. He can extend plays to find open receivers to get them time. What play you got pulled up? What's that is? It's a Josh Allen play against you guys. No, I ain't watching that. Oh, come on. I ain't watching no Josh Allen play beat us. <laughs> they cheated. Bills break the huddle. Third and goal. Oh, cool. I was an honest play. I can watch this. Josh Allen goes shotgun. No, jeez, I know this play. He don't have this. I know this play right there. Allen moving to his right. The play's never over until you hear the whistle, and that's a play that defines it. Allen buying time. Allen throwing. End zone. Come on, Gabe Davis. If you watch when he throws the ball, Gabe's completely covered. Like, I don't know how he saw him. Early in his career, he probably would have just went off the field and taken the yards. But nowadays, it seems like he's, he's trying to rely more on his skill players to make those plays for him. He's getting so evolved with this game just as far as knowing what defenses he's getting. You're like, I'm going back in zero. I'm like, all right, I want you to break from pylon right now. You can see the development over the years. Hey, Josh, good ass job, bro. Keep, keep taking what they give us. Joe Burr and Patrick Mahone, that Josh Allen is 1,000% up there as well. He's different than all the rest of those guys because he's built up like a defensive end. And he can run you over if you're not careful. 
we was watching film, he dropped back, and once he hit his back foot, he just took off because he seen the line. It was not a draw. The offensive line wasn't blocking for him. Wide receivers was running route. But he just seen it and he read the defense so fast. And then he not going down. He won't contact at the end of the play. That's what we thrive on. That's what we live on. I love that. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's a fiery competitor. A guy who's going to go out there and absolutely give it his all to a point where you want him to slide at some points. You know what time it is, Mitch. He stiff for him to do from L.A. He took that defender and threw him down like he was a rag doll. And he hurdles Reed from the Chiefs. They threw him in the highlight film for that one. Josh Allen left over Justin Reed. He, like, jumped over somebody against the Jets. Everybody was like, whoa, that was crazy. Josh Allen leaps over the head of LaMarcus Joyner. You see him run over DBs all the time. I don't want to end up on that low light. <laughs> if the quarterback ever did that to me, like, I'm... Uh, coach, give me off the field right now. Like, give me off the field. Right. Josh is one of those guys that doesn't want his teammates to see him getting treatment or hurting. It's really unique to him. It's very cool. It's the 10th or 11th play of the drive. We're all gas. We call a quarterback run, and I pull around. And he just takes off right next to me, and then I'm doing the fat man jog as fast as I can behind him, but he is booking it. Look at the center, boys. He just finds another level. This is kind of the epitome of who he is as a football player. It's been fun to see him grow as a person, as a leader. It's been such a privilege to see him grow and see him be unchanged through all the success. Became one of the faces of the NFL, and it's going to be awesome to see where he's going to continue to go.